Overpaying for Windows 10 and 11 activation keys. <laughs> <laughs> With VIP URCD key, you can install and activate Windows for only 16 bucks. Hey, that's pretty good. It's fast, easy, and 100% legit. To get started, head over to VIPURCDKey.com and search for the software that you're looking for and add it to your cart. If you're installing Windows, be sure that the key you purchase is the same as what is installed on your system. Once your product is in the cart, you can now enter my new promo code for 2023, RAV25, which will now save you 25% on your purchase. From here, you just need to follow the prompts and purchase your key with your preferred payment method. I personally always choose PayPal. Once your payment is done, navigate to your user center and click on My Purchased Orders. This is where you'll find your activation code once your payment is processed. From here, it's as easy as copying your key from the user center and pasting it into the Windows activation page on your desktop. You'll now have a fully activated version of Windows 10 that is also upgradable to a Windows 11 if you want. So check out the links below and save yourself some money. Now, let's get back to the video. Gamer and parent look were bad. Actually, it's not that crazy at all. Let me explain. As gamers or any other type of computer user that is staring at a screen for hours a day, we are straining our eyes and messing up our sleep cycle by introducing harsh light into our eyes that monitors emit. That's where Gamer Advantage Eyewear comes in. They take care of your eyes and help you get that much needed rest after a long gaming or work session so you can wake up refreshed and ready to dominate again. This is why I am proud to announce that the RA Visuals YouTube channel is now an official partner with the folks over at Gamer Advantage. So after a year of using their sandbox glasses with my own prescription in them, I can honestly say that they are something that I do not work or game without because as far as comfort, performance, and style, nothing else comes close. So if you want to wake up refreshed and ready to rock every morning, check out my links down in the description and save yourself some money on a fresh new set of Gamer Advantage Eyewear. I wear glasses. You guys don't? I love my Gamer Advantage glasses, man. These things are awesome. I got, you know how many pairs of these I got? What's going on, everybody? I see we got quite the chat going tonight. I love that. Great to see you guys. What's going on, man? Great to see you. Great to see you. Yeah, man, we got a ton of people in the chat today. What is going on? What's happening right now? Let me uh, let me do something really fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But up, but up, but up. Hold on, hold on. Hold up, hold up. What is going on with my soundboard? Does my soundboard work? There we go. Uh, did it work? I think it did. All right. Anyway, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Okay. Okay. You bought some, Josh? That's what I'm talking about, dude. Opera GX. I, you know, that's a that's a browser I've actually never tried. Maybe I should switch to that for like a little bit and see if it actually helps at all. You guys, do you guys have uh, good things to say about Op Opera GX? Oh, this is uh, chat. This is a LaCroix. You got it. You got to say it right when you say it. It is a LaCroix. Uh, my mother-in-law was staying with uh, my wife and I. Um, and she bought a bunch of these and left them here. So I, yeah. So I, uh, yeah, now, now they've, I've been drinking them cause my wife is, uh, is, uh, is pregnant again. And, uh, and she, and she doesn't, uh, doesn't really like these. Uh, thank you. Ruben lamb for subscribing. Appreciate you. Welcome to the visuals fam. My friend, happy to have you here. Um, Opera GX is pretty good for us gamers. Okay, okay. 
I believe you guys. I believe you. I believe you. All right, so guys, what we're going to do tonight, honestly, I'm here to hang out with you guys. I'm here to talk, and I'm here to, uh, we're going to shop a little bit. We're going to shop for some tech. Um, what I might do is I might, uh, I might just, like, look around for some deals. See if we can find some good tech deals that are going on right now. Um, and then also maybe, maybe we could put together some computer builds. I don't know what you guys think. Maybe we can do some different price points, possibly put together a couple of, uh, a couple of builds, you know, for different price points, you know, maybe it might help one of you guys out. Um, you have myopia. What is myopia? Myopia. What is that? Oh, you have near You could just say you're nearsighted, not a. You could just say you're nearsighted. Okay. Hey, that's that's the the better um that's the better way to say it, I guess. It's the, the college level word. You get bullied for using glasses at school and work. Why? I mean, look. I think I look pretty cool with these on. I I don't know, man. Uh, I'm disappointed no micro center here. Yeah, same here, man. I uh, I really wish I really really wish um, I had I had a micro center near me. Let's see They tech deals. Let's, let's just do that. Let's see who, who has tech deals right now um, Tech radar, let's see There's some appliances blah blah blah, okay Nah, it's not what I'm looking for. We'll have to search around, guys. Does RTX suck now? I don't think RTX ever sucked. I think it's it looks really good for sure. I just don't think many people use it, to be honest with you. I really don't. Anyway, let's hop in. Let's hop into uh, the interwebs. I'll take you guys with me here. There we go. Let's, uh, let's, so right now, let, let's, let's search Amazon, Micro Center, and Newegg. Those are the top three p th places that I usually search for tech. Let's see if they got some good deals going on, shall we? What, what do we got here? So, um, Micro Center has always got some kind of deal going on, man. They really do. They got the Radeon 6950 XT for 649 uh, oh, we got another subscriber, Alan De Lalo. Thank you for subscribing. Appreciate you. Very nice. Okay. I don't know where the picture went. Yeah, it used to be Fry's Electronics. Yeah, I don't know where the picture of the the GPU is, but <clears throat> for six forty nine, can we get one? Of, can we? Can you get that on eBay for that price? So we're gonna use eBay as well. Um, let's see, RX 6950 XT. Let's see what we can get. See, you can get one for 600 bucks right now. Buy it now, free shipping. Ooh, 565. 65. Free shipping, buy it now. Ooh, that's not bad. That is not bad. Why, why don't use eBay, not a... I buy GPUs on eBay all the time. In fact, the PC I was testing last stream had a GPU that I bought off of eBay and it worked beautifully. There's nothing wrong with it. It was actually really, really good. You can get a Red Devil for $600. Dude, that's not a bad price at all. This is actually kind of appealing right here. Damn. Red Devil cards are really good, too. I mean, for raw FPS, raw gaming performance, that's not a bad deal. I like that. I like that. Let's go. Okay, so Memorial Week deals. Let's see what let's see what they have. What are they what are they putting deals on? Uh, let's see. They got a laptop here. 12700H, RTX 3070 Ti, 8GB. 16 gigs of RAM, 512 solid stage. That's actually not bad for just over a thousand. The HP Omen. Yeah, that's not a bad looking laptop either. 
Oh, it's got a really, it's not a, it's, it's kind of a small power brick, but why'd they make it a square? That's weird. Why'd they do that? Hey, that case look great though. That power spec desktop. Oh, this guy here? So, yeah, it, it's 650, but dude, it doesn't even have a discrete card. It's one of those ones where they, they build you a, a PC with a, a 5700G. Yeah, guys, we can, we could go build one of those on PC Power Picker right now for way less than that. It's got a 400 watt power supply, you guys. I, I wouldn't buy that. I wouldn't touch that. Yeah, definitely not. They're, de they're selling Optiplex 3000 series. That's funny, dude. So see, okay, guys, a lot of you ask me why I don't do content on Optiplexes anymore. And it's because if I did, I would have to, uh, I would have to still use the old Optiplexes because the new ones are all like this. They're all small like this. You can't put a discrete graphics card in them. You can't, like, you can only use a single slot card if you guys see. It literally will only accommodate, like, a single slot card because of the way this power supply is set up. It's got these weird proprietary cables in it, too, and it's just, like, the newer ones are just such a hassle. It'd be great to do it because, look, it's got an i5-12500. This is, like, a brand new Optiplex. But even the ones that came, like, a, like a, a few generations before, they're, like very difficult to uh to, to like make into a gaming pc now let's see so a lenovo legion tower 5i 12700 an rtx 3060 ti 32 gigs of ram one terabyte solid state drive that might be like not terrible it actually looks pretty good too it's got the mustard cables yeah i'm not a fan of the ketchup and mustard either man uh, let's see. I'll never get another gaming laptop. I got an ROG laptop 3070 paperweight next to me. Are you serious, Kappa? Dude, I have my I have my ROG Zephyrus that has a 3070 in it, and that is like one of the best laptops I've ever owned. I still use it all the time. I I use that thing like every day. It's it's, it's such a great machine. What what happened to your laptop, man? I'm, I'm sorry to hear that, first of all. Let's see. Oh, this is a good price right here. Look at this. We got a 2K quad HD. Yeah, so 1440p. 170 hertz with FreeSync and G-Sync compatible. Now, is it a... What kind of panel is it, though? Is it an IPS panel? Probably not. It's probably a VA panel. Maybe it's not the best deal. Yeah, if they don't list it, it's probably a VA panel. Oh no, it's IPS. Okay. That's actually then that's a good deal. It's actually not a bad deal for that. Uh yeah, I sent it back and it was past warranty. Oh wow. So yeah, if you have yeah, if it's past warranty, that is unfortunate, man. I'm sorry. That is very unfortunate. Yeah. Yeah, mine, mine actually, uh, something happened with mine and I was able to actually fix it. I had to, uh, I, I broke it open. I replaced one of my SSDs. Um, on mine, the actual boot drive SSD was corrupt and broken. So I replaced that with a new SSD and it's never worked better. Things awesome. I think I put like a Sabrent rocket in there and that those SSDs are great. Let's see what else we got here. What else do we got? It's not the best price ever for a power supply. Not gonna lie. Um, let's see what else do we got. SSD replacement. Yeah, yeah, that was easy actually. So here's a Strix right here. I'm not. Is anybody out there? Are you guys fans of like 17 inch laptops? I'm not. I've never been a fan of those. I've I've always been about like a 15 inch laptop. I don't know why. I feel like 17 is just a little too big. To like lug around with you everywhere. I also got a 4070 in it and a 7945HX. Okay. This Asus Tough right here though has the 7940HS and then a 4060. That's actually not. That's not terrible.
terrible, I don't think. Yeah, 17 is... The 17-inch ones are just... Yeah, they're way too big in my opinion. Oh, here's a better buy right here, actually. 13700H and a 4070. That's really nice. Some good specs right there. Um... Okay, they got a lot of laptops. So what what systems? So here we go. It's like this power spec again. So 449. I'm telling you guys, I can I can go on PC Part Picker and part you guys a, a, a PC like this for way, for like $300. I think. I'm pretty sure you can get this for like $300. With if you want to add a 5600G or the other one that has graphics already on it. Do you want a game on that? You pull 18 pounds of stuff in your backpack? Jeez. Yeah, it looks like a Leanne Lee case, but it's one of their lower end ones, I think, dude. Um, so here, so here, look, so here's one of the ones that like everybody asked me. This is one of the Optiplexes everybody asked me about. They asked, like, hey man, can you show us how to do stuff with this? But again, I'm trying to tell you guys. It's the same thing. You can't really accommodate another graphics card, but except for a single slot one, because the way they make them now, they make them all these SFF, uh, and these F SFF cases. And I don't, I, I believe you can case swap these, but it's, man, I think you have to, I don't know if there's, uh, connectors and stuff like that out there yet for these. If there is, I need to look into it and see if I can actually get one of these guys and possibly do like a case swap on it. Because that price is even probably a little too much for one of these because on eBay, you can get these a little cheaper. What is this? A 7040? Let me look on eBay real quick. Dell Optiplex 7040. Do these come in a mini tower? Oh, these come in a mini tower. Okay, so here's the thing with this though, guys. So yes, they do come in a mini tower, but... The way the mini towers work, can you accommodate another graphics card? I think these ones you might be able to. I, but I think these the way these these open up really weird. I gotta find a, a proper photo for you guys to show you. Hold on, let me maybe one of these will have a photo so I can show you. Can you show it open, please? See, this one already has a graphics card in it. Um. That one has an i7 in it too. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Here, let's just Google it. Optiplex 7040 open. Let's see, images. Okay. Yeah, see, it, like they have, it's like, it's configured in this weird way like this. And it has this weird thing right here. So even so, I think when you open it, I think you're still very limited on what graphics card you could put in here because all this other stuff like sandwiches it. Let me try to find you guys a good photo for it. Yeah, it kind of looks like. Yeah, it kind of looks like this. You see what I'm saying? Oh, that's a SFF again. Hold on. Anyway. Yeah, so, yeah, Keith. That's what I'm talking about. See, like the, uh, the, th the, th the, like the 36, what is it? The one that I just did, the 3620. That one's really awesome. The 3600 series. Those are like, those are what I'm kind of starting to cover now because they're very easy to modify. And they're very easy to just... Chuck a graphics card in there and you're good to go. Or you can also upgrade the power supply and put an even better um, graphics card in there. So, yeah. People ask me all the time to do Dell Optiplex content again. And I'm like, dude, I know you guys want me to because they're cheap. But it's like as games are evolving now, it's starting to be less of a, a, a uh, I don't know, less of a thing that I, I will suggest to people. Because they, uh, yeah, they don't really, they don't really work too well as anymore. The, the CPUs are starting to get bottlenecked these days. Uh, 649. So yeah, see, here's one of those ones that has a 12400, but it has no graphics card. I mean, like a, what do you call it? 
a guy like this or a thing like this you could you could actually add a, if it will show the pictures for some reason micro center is not showing pictures why is it doing that there it goes so yes this tower i've actually built something like this from my parents actually i bought a pc just like this you can accommodate a gpu and something like this so if you were to buy this you could then add a graphics card in there later but again it's not like insanely cheap uh anmar what's up man you have a gtx 1060 and still runs with josh dude it's time it's time to replace that thing man let me see let me see let's let's look at graphics cards they have uh computer parts do they have any graphics cards on sale right now? Doesn't look like it. Here, let's, uh, products, PC parts. What do they got for graphics cards? Let's see. 839 This is cheaper on Amazon. One available to ship. What? Oh, anyway. Oh, some of these are in-store only prices. That's right. That's right. Yeah. I'm, Josh, I'm telling you, man. Just upgrade to like, get a 4070 Ti. Those are really nice. There's a 4090 for sixteen hundred dollars. That's an in-store only price. It's pretty good. Oh, it sucks. You can get Diablo for free. By the way, guys. Uh, I already preloaded Diablo 4. It's ready to go. Uh, what do we got? Like two days? So yeah, for uh, on my on my gaming channel, you guys will definitely definitely see me. Um, what do you call it? Yeah, you'll definitely see me playing that game. Raven, what's good? Uh, I would not pay over a thousand dollars for a graphics card. Hey, you know what? Right now, I wouldn't either anymore. I, I back in the day, or you know, back a couple years ago when you had to, um, I was one of those idiots that did. But uh, yeah, uh, will Keith? Will you really? If I wanted a forty seventy Ti, you'd you'd sell you'd sell me one. I might actually, I might actually, I was thinking about grabbing a 4070 Ti to put into my gaming rig, and then I'm going to take my 3080 Ti and put it in my editing rig. Because I don't, I mean, I don't want to pay more than what a 4070 Ti costs, and I feel like the performance that you get from these, you know what I'm saying? I feel like they're pretty good for what they are. Although it only has 12 gigabytes of DDR, what doesn't matter. You got a 4070 Ti PNYOC and I have zero clue what to do with it. Okay. All right, Keith, we might have to talk. Might have to talk. Once I uh, once I once I sell one of my PCs, I may have to uh, I may have to cop that off you, dude. All right, Nade, thanks for stopping by and hanging out with us, man. Come back anytime you want, my guy. We'll be around. What's up, Josh? Um, top deals and PC parts. What, what are the deals? Let's see. Ooh, guys. By the way, if you guys are looking for a budget GPU right now, the 6650 XT is 219. Oh, man. I have this exact same one in a build already. This is one of the ones that I got during Christmas. This, this GPU is so good, man. It's actually, like, surprisingly good. It really is. Oh, man. I mean, look at this. You can get a freaking RX 6600 for 179 now. Josh, why don't you just get one of these, man? Seriously. I also need to offload your 6800 XT. Okay, okay, okay. You're gonna stick with your RX 580 for a while until it struggles and you'll upgrade. That's cheaper than the 6500 XT I got for 270 during the shortage. Yeah, man. Yeah, this this one right here, this is a good card. Eight gigs of GDR6, 
And uh, yeah, you can play games at 1080p high settings and you can play 1440p too. It's a really good card. And the 6650s, I, I love these cards, man. These are, these are great. I've tested them myself and uh, they're really nice. Man, you can get a 6750 XT for 379. That's a really, really dope price on that. It's a great card, man. Those are those have such good uh what do you call it? Such good uh performance for the money. Really good cards. Yep. Another good one, another good one that I actually just started as I was just testing was the uh RX 5700s. Check it out. Is it what? Oh, okay, that's normal. Never mind, never mind, never mind. Power color, 5700 XT for 150 bucks. Free shipping. That's a deal. That's a deal right there. I'm telling you guys. You can find the 5700s for even cheaper. Like, this is the one that I got right here. And at, like, out the door, I think it was like 50, 150 bucks, like, with taxes and, and shipping and all that. But you can get them even cheaper, dude. It's crazy. And uh, as you guys saw, if you guys watched my last stream yesterday, I got some insane, insane freaking, what do you call it? Uh, performance out of that thing. It was pretty awesome. Anyway, let's check uh, Let's check good old Amazon. What do we got, what do we got going on, on Amazon right now? Let's see. Uh, let's see some deals in tech. What do we got? They always got some stuff going on on Amazon. Um, let's see. PC gaming. What do we got? Components. Let's see what we got here. What's on sale? Uh, so the 5600X is $156. Ooh, guys. Because of the new processors, look at this. The 5800X 3D is $288 now. Dude, I'm telling you, man. If you guys just want to put together a like absolute like butt kicker of an, a gaming PC, buy this and pair it with one of those GPUs I was just talking about. It absolutely will still demolish games at 1440p even like man i swear to god you only need like the top end stuff if you're looking to play a 4k and if you're not looking to play a 4k stuff like like a couple generations old it, it will just be insanely good it really is it's it's really really funny how good this stuff is still you'll upgrade your card soon I'm tell you man you should it's kind of crazy i could pick this up right here and throw it in this PC you're sitting right next to me and then make that a gaming build like pick up this right here I could I could honestly swap these two PCs like pick up this this processor put it in there for gaming and then put a for like a 4070 Ti or whatever you know in this and then put the 3080 Ti this system over here and use it as an editing PC and then you know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. It might be the most cost-effective thing is just to buy like something like this. Um, I got a 5600X and a 6700XT and I'm maxing 1440p on most games. Exactly, Kappa. That's what I'm saying. You don't need much, you guys. Like, and that's, that's a very, very like... That's a very good combo. 5600X and 6700XT is a very popular combo. And that plays games at 1440p so well. Um, although if you're in the US, might as well go to Micro Center and grab a 7900X B650 combo for 580. Yeah, dude, I, I if I could go to a Micro Center, uh, Keith, I would, man. I'm not I don't live near one. Like the nearest micro center to me is probably all the way in California somewhere. And that's like really far. I'd have to like fly a plane there, which is not worth it. Yeah, I live in Washington, so it, like it's not close to me at all. Yeah, now I, I don't have Micro Center, so I got to shop on here. 
But uh, man, I mean, it could be, it could be worth it for me to go for the uh, the newer stuff and just keep it like for a long time. But man, I don't know, man. A thirty sixty for two eighty nine is that? That's that's, that's that's a pretty good price. What can you get it for used? I always go down to the uh, the used offers. Typically, sometimes you can get them for even cheap, cheaper used. Uh, if they have like an Amazon warehouse deal on it sometimes, sometimes you can get them even cheaper. Ah, uh, it doesn't look like they have one. So mad, no Dunkin' Donuts here. Yeah, Black Wolf, dude, I miss Dunkin' Donuts from when I was on the East Coast for a little while uh, for military training. I, Dude, I used to eat Dunkin' Donuts like every day. Uh, you picked up 3060 TIs for 285. That's that's about right about there. Yeah, it's right up right about the right price. Uh, what do I got in my cart? Wi-Fi 7. Um, yeah, I got this uh this this uh what do you call it? Mesh mesh kit. It's home mesh kit. Um, I'm getting that, and I'm gonna do I'm gonna be doing a video on it. I'm actually I'm not buying that. I'm actually getting that sent to me for free. I was just looking that up for a uh for a video. And I just had it in my car to save it. Uh, but this company is actually sending this this kit over to me. I'll show you guys. Yeah, they're called Dynalink. Yeah, they hit me up and they are uh, they're sending one of these over to me to uh, to do a video on, and I'm gonna be testing it throughout my whole home and seeing uh, what my my Wi-Fi will be like after that. My Wi-Fi is already really good. Um, but there are some dead spots outside, outside of my house, like on my porch and stuff. So I wonder if using something like this will really extend it like to even the outside parts of my house. So we'll see. Yeah, so this allows you to have like how many, how many? Yeah, you can connect up to 200 devices on it. That's kind of insane. Yeah. So yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to end up doing a video on that for you guys because I've never really done a video on a, uh, like a Wi-Fi or an internet product. So I figured I might as well tap into that too. Why the hell not, right? All right, let's go back to where we were. Where, where are we at? In here, okay. Let's see. What is that? Okay. 5900X. Oh, look, the 7900X 3D. This is what I was actually looking at getting. Is it on sale, really? It doesn't look like it. That's like the normal price. So <clears throat> I was looking at grabbing this for my gaming PC. So the idea, the idea, you guys, is I'm going to take my current gaming PC and like what's in it. And that will be my new editing PC because like Intel and and uh, Intel and uh, oh my God, I'm drawing a blank and Nvidia. Sorry, my God, I couldn't think Intel and Nvidia play really well with Adobe which is what I edit with um, and I'll use that as my editing PC now it's because I can use I can take advantage of Intel's quick syncs features and all that and I'll render faster and all that so I'll use that as my editing rig and then maybe this guy right here plus and you know the, I gotta buy a new motherboard all that crap and then use that as my gaming PC or or I could again keep all that as a really nice editing rig and then, like I said, cannibalize parts out of here and go with just the, the 58, the 5800 X3D, which is still an amazing gaming CPU and a really nice graphics card and use that in my, in, in this configuration, possibly put it in a different case, change the look and use that for a gaming PC. Because sometimes it's like, do you, do you really need the absolute top of the line? The answer is no, you really don't. You need what, what is best for you and what you use it for. And I don't even play games at 4k anyway, guys. I don't, I really don't. So like for what I use it for, I could get away with something like this with a 4070 Ti and I bet you I'd be, I'd be, you know, it'd be, it'd be really good. <laughs> but 
But I wonder, I, I don't know, is the 57, the 5800X 3D, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's, this beats the 12700K in gaming, right? Yeah, I saw that too. What, what is that? Hold on. Let me see. Yeah, what is this? Oh, it's the, the AMD 50th anniversary version of that. Yeah, that's weird. It matches the 12900K in most games. Yeah, so there you go. That's what I'm saying. It's like, it's like stupid, stupid good performance for not a lot of money. So like for me, I could pick this guy up right here for 288 bucks. And then I could pick up a new graphics card and just use what I got in this PC right here already. I already got an X570 board and I got a bunch of RAM and I got everything for the gaming PC and there you go and then i got an editing pc right there that for me guys seems like my best option so here let's go to pc part picker real quick this is what i kind of wanted to do tonight i kind of wanted to throw throw this out here and see what i could do here so like honestly yeah the this looks the 7800x 3d looks looks sexy and all that Like, it, it, it's sex. It, like, it's it's nice to have the top of the line, like the newest stuff. Yes, it would be really awesome. But then I'm I'm spending a lot more money on that. Cause look, if I went with a, let's just let's just let's just spit all this. If I went with that, which is what I was thinking of doing, I don't need a CPU cooler. I got an extra one laying right there that I'm gonna have to test anyway. We gotta pick a motherboard. So let's go with the lowest price ones. I'm not going to go with an A620, obviously. Um, I wouldn't go with a... What's, what's like the even the cheapest like ATX board? This guy here? I probably wouldn't even buy this, but this is like the cheapest B650 board you could go with. And then I have to buy some more memory. Because I need more DDR5 memory because I have my DDR5 is all being used up in my editing PC right or my other PC right there This PC is still using DDR4 Um, let's see What can we get here? I mean, yeah, you can get some really I mean, really cheap Like really cheap memory Let's see. I want to do. Let's do a. Let's do a filter here. Let's do like uh, two by sixteen because I want thirty-two gigs. That's what I. That's what I always use. Um, the true classic. Like, yeah. Let's go with like the cheapest I can get. Fifty-six hundred. You think the Z5 Trident? Oh, j just because they're just because they're reliable. Is that what you think, Keith? Looks like these team group ones are only 72 bucks for a for a 32 gigabyte kit right here. Look, we're going to we're going to go the cheapest route we can go right now and see how much money I got to spend for this right here and then we got to buy a video card. And what's like the yeah, here you go like the tough gaming 4070. It's $800. So that's kind of what I'd be going after. Okay, so for all that, I'm looking at almost $1,500. You see what I'm saying? It's a lot of money, guys. It's a lot of money to spend on that. Yeah, $1,500 for all that because I gotta, I gotta switch to a new platform. You know what I mean? Versus, I could just do this. Take all that off, and I pay for a new CPU that costs half of what the other one does. I buy that CPU, a new graphics card, and I'm just at over $1,000 for those two things. And I essentially will have a new gaming PC by just buying two things. See what I'm saying? 
And it'll, it'll even be cheaper if I end up buying a 4070 Ti from Keith in the chat here. Because he said he'd sell me his for 700 So think about it as it's actually under $1,000. I'd be getting this combo for around like 900 bucks. And then I essentially have an insanely good editing PC. And then I also have a basically still pretty top of the line gaming PC. Mid to top. Mid to top, I'll say that. It's not top of the line. I'll say mid to top tier. That will play anything I want to play, right? Can we all agree on that? I don't know. Just seems like the option. I think it just seems smart. It just seems smart. Yeah, this is a very, very dope price on these. I wonder what they are on eBay. Uh, 5,800X. That's brand new. 3D. What can you get these for on eBay? They're like, they're more expensive on eBay. Ooh, guys. 255 right there. With $10 shipping, that's it's basically the same price. Yeah, they're the same price on eBay. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't know, man. This is this is a it's a damn good deal, you guys. For the fa for the for the the simple fact that I already basically have what I need for it. Yeah. Well, AM4 is still really good, Keith. That's the thing. It really it really is, and like. For a, for a, for a freaking computer that's just gonna be playing games, like that's all it's doing. I really don't care that much. Now, here's where, here's where I would switch platforms and fully just go with AM5 as if I decide I'm gonna go back to just using a single PC again. If I did that, then I would basically sell both of these and then take the proceeds and then put that towards a one single insanely good PC it could do that uh, Bruce Wayne Valley what's up man micro center near me has good Intel AMD bundles of RAM mobile and CPU yeah I wish Bruce I really wish that I could take part in all that fun that you guys are talking about at micro center you're just you guys are just hitting me hard with this stuff because I <laughs> I literally like I literally can't take part in this because I don't live near a micro center, man. I wish. I really wish. I wish so much that I could just go to a micro center right now and buy what I want to buy. But unfortunately, your boy lives too far away from him. I do. In the closest... Honestly, here, let's look. Micro center near me. Let's see. Where's the nearest lo uh, store locations? Where's the, where's the nearest location? They need to they need to have more more places. Let's see. Yeah, there's no there's one there's nothing near me. Yeah, they're all on the East Coast, man. I think the closest one would be Denver, Colorado or California. It'd be so, man. How far is Tustin? <laughs> yeah, to put this in perspective, guys. I think the Colorado store is closer. To put this in perspective for you guys. That store is here. I live here. In Washington, on the east side of Washington. Yeah, that's a long drive. So actually, I think the Denver store is probably closer to me because I could drive right through Idaho, Wyoming to Colorado. I don't know. They're both pretty much the same distance away and they're really far. Yeah, there's no way. <laughs> What's Newegg got? You know what? We haven't checked Newegg. Uh, what are they selling the 5800X 3D for? Yeah, see, they still got it above three hundred dollars.
That's why we have flat rate shipping from USPS. You you do, Keith? It's a nice little combo right there. Yeah, see, they're still they're still selling for three twenty two on on uh on what do you call it on New Egg. Telling you that's a that's a deal, man. Yeah, your boy might have to pick this up, you guys. I may have to grab this. Even like before, before I buy the new GPU, I might buy this first because this is an insane deal. Okay, I'll switch it. Give me like five seconds. What? All right, guys, I have to take a break for two seconds. I gotta go move my car because I forgot my wife has to wait. She have to work tomorrow? I guess she's working tomorrow. I didn't realize that. Anyway, I gotta go move my car out the way. I'll be right back. Let me uh let me go to this. There you go. You have to poop. <laughs> Alright. Well go 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 to the bathroom, everybody. Go grab some snacks. And I'll be right back. I think when I get back, we might do some gaming. Because I kind of already have in my mind what I want to buy now. Like once I once I'm able to, I think I know what I wanna wanna get to upgrade my systems. Um, I got the idea now, but uh, I'll be right back. And then when I get back, we're probably gonna hop into some gaming. So if you guys wanna see a certain game, if you guys wanna if you guys wanna if any of you in the chat wanna play something, let me know. And maybe we'll do that. So hold on, we'll be right back. All right, everybody, we're back. So yeah, I bet I had to uh, want my fart sound when you come back. Did you did you go poop or not, Josh? Did you did you actually go or not?
No, soon? Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Ooh, guys, check this out. Before we, before we hop into some gaming or something, check this out. So, they have a, an RX 590, these, the, I guess it's Acerisks, I guess, is that, is that how you say it? For a hundred dollars, you can get an RX 598 gigabyte, 2340 screen processor. Fifty one RS risk. Do I dare? <laughs> A fifty six hundred XT for this. Yes, you can. Absolutely, you can. Yeah, see here's all the here's all the the 2048 stream processor cards. They got one for 89.99 now. They got a bunch of them on New Egg. Wow. Crazy. Here's a 5700 right here. See, 150 bucks. It's a good price for that. One of these right here. I think this is a 2304 stream processor as well, but. So that you tell me that RX 590 has the same stream processor count as that. It's a 2304 stream processor. I wonder, man, I hit. <laughs> It'd be kind of fun to pick one of these up and uh, and do a, f a video on this. And see how the RX 590 does. But yes, there's an RX 5600 XT, but they're selling it for 155 bucks. So I don't know. I don't know. They got a look at this. They got a ton of cards right here. Crazy. They got, they're the ones that have the 5700 too. 159 bucks. So like, how is it compared to the 580? Are you talking about the, the 590? Which one are we talking about? Oh, we're having my music. Uh, that is Micro Center. This guy, are you talking about the, oh, the 590 versus 580? So I'm pretty sure the 590, if I remember right, has like a pretty substantial performance increase. Like it might be like another one of those 10% or 15% though. Let's let's check her out then. Let's watch a YouTube video, shall we? Let's do it. Let's see what this video has to say from WePC. We PC, thank you for doing this, whoever whoever you are. Appreciate you. All right, so we got the 590 here, the 580 here. And it looks like a 1080p, it's not very much of a difference. Yeah, it doesn't look very, it doesn't look very, yeah. Okay, so 5% faster, yeah. It doesn't look like it's very, very much like, very much difference. So Black Wolf, I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't worry about that. For you, because you already have a 580, man, I would be looking towards a, a newer generation card if you're going to upgrade, for sure. Yeah, see? Yeah, it's it's not very much better. It really isn't. You can see a little more of a difference at 1440p, but not, not much. Yeah, so there you go. But yeah, I don't know. I just thought it was interesting because this would be kind of f a funny video too because it's a 590 for $100, which is kind of cool. So, I don't know. Anyway, I think I found I think I think found my my uh, my idea, guys. I think I got to get this 5800X 3D. It's a very good price. I think I got to, I got to, at that price, I think I got to pick that up. 
um, for the gaming build. And then we'll, like I said, we will make this into the gaming PC. After all, it does look like a gaming PC anyway. If this is the one that's like way more flashy looking. And then we'll make the uh, the more subdued PC my my editing and streaming PC. I think that's what we do. I think we just switch them. But that also means I gotta take all my hard drives out of this PC, throw them over into this one, and then <laughs> that's gonna be fun. I gotta make sure I have enough, uh, what do you call it, USB ports on that motherboard to like put all my hard drives I have. I have a bunch of external hard drives and shit too. So we'll see. We'll see if that'll work. But, uh, anyway, so what I think we want to do now, I think I'm, I think I want to play some games guys, but I don't know what I want to play. It's one of those times where I, uh, I want to play Diablo, but Diablo's not out yet. Have you got more desk pads or keyboards? Not right now, Josh, but I will. But I will. I will. Uh, Fortnite. You guys should play some Fortnite. Well, if we're gonna play Fortnite, I might as well play Modern Warfare 2. Do I, do I not have that installed on my... That is so funny. I think I uninstalled it. I did. I did. I did. You gonna pass me up on uh, mouse pads? I don't know about that, man. I, I haven't bought any new ones recently. And I also, I haven't really gotten any new keyboards, like, super recently. Alright, Raven. Sounds good, man. Have a good night. Sleep well. Yeah, I think I actually uninstalled the game. That's so funny. I think I got so tired of it. Uh, if I check the, oh, you know what? Let's, let's check the Discord real quick while we're doing this. Let's go ahead and check it. Why not? Let's check some Discord. Let's check the Discord and see what we're talking about here. Well, I could play some more Dead Island too. I haven't really, uh, I haven't really completed that game. Or I could hop into Hogwarts Legacy. You want to? <laughs> yeah. I uninstall COD too. All right, let's hop into our. Uh... Uh, let's see. Where'd you Where'd you post it at? Did you put it in general? Oh, on PC. There you go. Uh, blew off your PC. Oh, dude. I did, I missed this. Was that you? Dude, I love... I love that case, man. That case is dope. So is it a, uh, is it this one right here? This, 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 uh, accelerate one. I got you. Is it this accelerate card right here? Yeah, this is a very nice PC right here. I think that card would look great in this build right here, which is very similar to what you got right there. Like this, <laughs> my PC right here looks so similar to that. It's like the same cooler and everything. That's funny as hell. It's actually very, very similar. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think we might, maybe we could talk, Keith. Might have to, uh, you know, set up a PayPal or used to be a 5800X 3D 4070 showcase. Well, that's pretty much what I'm going to do, man. I think that's what I that's think that's what I'm going for. So I think for a gaming build, just a simple just a, a strictly gaming build, I think that's more than enough. Don't we think? Don't we think everybody? That's pretty awesome. Now, I I guess I I could keep my 3950X and just Put a 4070 Ti in there and game on it. I guess I could do that. I could literally just buy a new graphics card and that's it. And not buy the processor. 
Oh, I got you. Yeah, yeah, the cables. Now, this is a good looking PC, man. I like the color scheme. I like it. It looks good. I like that you put the uh, the GPU sag thing right here that has the uh, that has the RGB on it, so you can make it all look the same color. That looks that looks dope, man. Looks good. Very very nice looking build, for sure. But then this one right here, I just like this case. I would 100% buy this case. This thing is actually like really really dope looking. Really like that. Oh yeah, it <laughs> didn't want to show that at all. Yep. Yeah, dude, for sure. So did I did I see somebody said we should uh Black Wolf, you think we should play some uh, some Dead Island and kill some zombies? Is that what you're saying? Fractal North is on sale for like 120 at the moment. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, yes, I like that. I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> we could just do our usual gaming gauntlet. Like I could just play like every game just for fun. You know what I mean? Just hop into all the games and just run through them and see what happens. You know what I mean? All the games I typically play. Uh, Fortnite has an update. So I guess Dead Island will have to be what we play. Yeah. I guess we're hopping back into Dead Island. All right, let's kill some zombies. Let's cut the music. All right, Dead Island it is. Let's go. I could also play some PC Building Simulator, which I, I love playing that game, but uh, I think I think Dead Island. I think Dead Island would have to happen. I, it's it's a very good game. I I really enjoy it. Although it doesn't like 360 mil revs in front with anything bigger than the 3090 FE, Fractal needs to make an XL version. Ah, I see what you're saying. Yep. Well, this case right here that I already have, you can put anything in it. It can accommodate two graphics cards this way, probably. It's it's pretty awesome. All right. Unreal Engine. Let's go. AMD, together we advance. Except for I'm not using an AMD card or an AMD CPU, so. All right. Let's put the CPU, let's put the FPS counter up in the top and see what I'm getting. I'm pretty sure I got pretty good frames in this game. I remember, right? I don't remember what I'm playing, like what I'm playing it on. Uh, oh, shader caching is in progress. Yeah, we gotta do that. You wanna do that at least to keep the game going. So I played this game, uh, I believe, like one night, and I uh, I played a I played a tad bit of it, but I haven't, you know, I haven't done a lot. So, yeah, we're. What am I playing it at? Let me see. Display, full screen, V sync. No. Oh, actually, yeah, because I'm trying to hit 144. That's right. I have it on V sync to hit 144. That's all. I think I. So what's the Advanced, right, right. I think I played on Ultra. Yeah, I have, everything, I have everything turned all the way up. That's right. Cool. Single player. Let's see. I can't remember what kind of build I was going for or what I'm doing, but uh, pretty sure I was getting some good frames in the game. This this gaming PC already like does so well. Like it really does. Was I getting? Oh, uh, yeah, like a hundred. I was thought I was getting like a hundred something usually. Yeah, very very stable. Just looks nice too. All right, it's like 120 is like the usual. All right, let's turn that off. Let's play. Sam, if we're immune, we need to tell the authorities. <laughs> sure, if you want to get. <clears throat> Yeah, Josh, I got it with a uh, with that the 6650 XT I bought for Christmas. It came with this and the Callisto protocol. You're immune. You ain't bite proof. I've gone toe to toe. I know how it is. You don't. 
Oh crap, I need to change the uh thing. It's your ass. We're gaming now. Hey, if you're going out there, you're gonna need some special sauce. Grab that machete. Change that. There we go. <clears throat> your first GPU was the 65 6500. I was disappointed. Yeah. I wouldn't go for that. This is how but the 6600, the 6600 XT and the 6650 XT are great. GPUs, they're really great. <clears throat> Help yourself the parts you can use, blah blah blah. Okay. Right. <clears throat> Where am I supposed to go? Oh. <clears throat> Wait for the price to go down, Dead Island. Saints Row is 26 bucks. I heard bad game, my cousin told me. Oh, okay. My dad got it for me. I have the RX 580 now, and it's great. Yeah, the 580 still is a really good gaming CPU or uh, GPU, man. Okay. Oh, the workbench. So we can make stuff. Uh, use workbench to repair your weapons, customize them, devastating effects, and bonuses. Okay. Uh, what can I do to it? Mods. Oh, now it's electrified, dude. Sick. Okay. Okay, so now I have an enhanced and a machete. Okay. What else can I do? Uh, I have a lot of weapons, I'm pretty sure. Can I enhance, like... What is this? My wreckage? Oh. Pretty sure... I broke that. Can I enhance my hammer? Let's try to enhance the hammer. Oh, can you not? Oh, you have to... Does it have to be a certain color to actually do that? Oh, let's do... Yeah, scrap that. Yeah, I think this is broken. Okay, so you can scrap all those. Reminds me of Dying Light. Yeah, it's it's pretty similar. Can I repair this? There we go. There we go, because that machete's awesome. Um. Oh, can I not do that yet? I guess I can't. It's locked. All right, let me repair this. Let me repair all my good weapons. Okay, so this thing is like my most devastating weapon. Cool. I have three pool cues. I don't really need all that. So let's just scrap the pool cues. We don't really need those. All right, we'll keep the rest of these. This thing, I... Mm, it's kind of crap. The rest of these are good. Okay, we'll keep those. All right, cool. Yes. Thanks, Sam. Indeed. Hey, if you're really going out there, I got some stuff you need. Okay. Take some of this meat as bait. Give zombies. I play Hell Let Loose too much, dude. Keith, I want to try that game, man. I got some meds you can have too. Just maybe next time you give me some. I think return. Hell Let Loose would be a game that I'd really like, cause I I I really enjoy uh, what do you call it? I really enjoy uh, World War II games. But Diablo 4 is about to come out, and um, that's the game I'll be playing the most, probably. What's this? Uh, rotten Stinky Flesh that is a catnip to zombies to lure them over, distract them while you escape. Oh. Oh, you can buy weapons from him, too. Okay. And then can I sell stuff to him? Yes, I can. Dope. Okay. Alloy. So this is all just, like, materials to do upgrades with, right? Okay. And then I can sell... Weapons if I want to. Alright, cool. Give him a Superman suplex. <laughs> a makeshift sword. Okay, so yeah, some of these are nice, but I'll, I'll probably find some stuff too. Heavy attacks. Fabrication of med kits at the workbench. Ooh. Are these free? Oh, it is tr it is free. Okay, well, we're taking that. 
Okay. Thanks. Appreciate it. Oh, I can make med kits now. Okay, cool. I currently have five. What can I not make anymore? Um, I have that. I I have it, but I think I have enough already, so I don't need to make another one. Okay, cool. It's a great game, although I wish Squad had 2023 graphics and keyboard bug out. What do you mean? What do you mean, Keith? Like like the keyboard doesn't work as well? Oh, storage locker. Okay, let's... Yeah, let's put that away. And the rest of these, I think, can stay. Yeah, because we need to use those. Actually, you know what? We're going to keep all these because I end up breaking all these weapons anyway. So, yeah, it's fine. Okay. Uh, let Emma know you're heading out to find the authorities. Okay. Where's Emma? Uh, upstairs. Okay. Let's play. Let's go kill some stuff. I got to remember the freaking buttons and stuff, too. Now my keyboard software is now in stro- Oh, I got you, I got you. Megan will end up in some dead fan's stomach. You won't let that happen, will you? If I'm immune, then I need to contact the authorities. Sam doesn't trust them. Look, my brother is counting on me to come back. I gotta go. We all want to leave. <laughs> you wouldn't believe what we had to pay to get on that plane. This game's got some really good graphics, man. Here. And we could try to break out. You can't just jump in a car and go. The roads are all blocked. I saw videos of cars getting swarmed. You might as well put wheels on a coffin. Yeah, no cars. There's millions of those things out there, just waiting to sink their teeth into us. Face it. Nah, need I'm gonna pile to drive them, dude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. What do you call that? Suplex that I can do. I am not ready to give up. Where's the nearest evacuation center? What are those guys doing? We were supposed to report to the helper in hotel. If Robert hadn't. Made other arrangements. You're not upset he's dead. A marriage was just PR, okay? Oh, well, who needs love when you're rich and famous, huh? Okay, Opera and Hotel. Thanks. Let's go. All right. Hey. Don't forget your friends. You do find a way out. I think I'll re grease my keyboard later today. Okay. Let's see. All right, let's get out of here. Yeah, we're sitting pretty steady at like 120 FPS. That's nice. All right, how do I how do I get outside? I feel like this house like is not the best house to like hold up in because like can't they freaking what do you call it like a zombie just break through this glass and get in here? All right, first of all, how the hell do I get out of here? These Emma's house keys. Okay, how, how do I get out? Oh, they gotta go downstairs. Like, go out through the garage or something. I do. Alright. I'm heading to the Halperin Hotel. See if the army's still there. Yes, yes, uh, good. Good, exactly what I was going to tell you to do. All part of my survival. Plan. Yeah, a zombie could just uh, smash through the windows. Exactly. Just tell them Emma Jaunt and her staff need to be evacuated immediately. Okay? Sure thing, Michael. Okay, Michael. Alright, slay out loud. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you can do Alexa. I, I, I don't... Right, I'm using my... Where's my... Where's my really nice... Slay... Oh, yeah, that's right. You can have somebody else come play with you. How do you... Yeah, can't you like make that your primary or something? There it is. Look at this thing. This thing's sweet. Need a key to open them. Okay. Alright, so where am I supposed to go? Ah, you can vault. Okay, cool. Yeah. 
Woohoo! There we go. This way. It must be the Alperin Hotel. Okay, I gotta remember all the buttons, like to jump at people and all that crap again. Shit. What just happened? Oh, is that is that a uh I guess I could have zapped him or something. Come towards me. I dare you. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Spinning image of dying light, but LA. Yeah, exactly. There's a battery if we need one. How do you wait? How do you uh, block again? Oh, it's this button, right? I don't remember how to heal either. Q. E. Nope. E is to hit people. How do you? Hold on. Controls. Uh. Uh, combat. Third weapons block. Left all. Okay, okay. Skull stomp. F. Drop kick. Space. Then E. Okay. Kick is an E. Got it. Got it. Okay. What is basics? How do you heal? Healing. H. Got it. H for healing. Got it. Makes sense. Okay. Can jump and do this thing. Oh, I missed. There you go. All right. So this, I got I want to get this for you guys. Watch this. Watch this. <laughs> you can just straight. Hiya! <laughs> that was cool. Yeah. That was a cool that was a cool little uh little thing there. I feel like that was a cool little death I just caused. That was pretty dope. Can it stop now? How do you uh make that stop? There you go. Ah, whatever. Alright, which way? Guess maybe I go this way. Can you sneak up on him and just... just stealth kill him? You stomp their heads. There you go. Okay. Cool. Wait. Somebody was somebody talking to me? Oh yeah, I can go in here, okay. Found some Finally, people. Some life out there. Uh, you're not much to look at, but I'll take a chance on you. Uh, say, you seen another kid out there? Not seen anyone alive. Damn it. Must have thought I was shooting at her and got spooked. Well, uh, listen, if I get the gate, can you search the front? 
You find that girl and you bring her around back. Sure. Straighten this thing out. Just watch out for the other trespassers. They might. <laughs> hey, get out of there, you scourge of a Satan. Some cavalry in this movie. Wonder if can you play this game with a controller? Okay. Oh fuck. I gotta find the old guy before we get him too. Alright, I'm getting better at the combat. There we go. Oh no, she died. We couldn't save her, guys. I don't think you're supposed to be able to. I'm pretty sure that's part of the game. Hmm. Do we let them out? I think we do. Uh oh. Oh god. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> ah! That could have been bad. So, do you find guns in this game ever? Or is it just is it just melee weapons? Uh I'll take the rake. Kinda nice. Oh, we can put the fire out, right. Oh, what's this? Scaffold pole. Alright, take that too. Uh, pretty sure you can play this with whatever. I think just melee. Reinforced perk, nice. Oh, there's a workbench right here too. Yeah, can I plug in the controller and play this? Because I like games like this, I like playing with a controller. Yes, I can. Alright. Might be a little less accurate though. Oh, controller's being weird. Stop it. Um. Healing. Oh, down. Okay. Rumble on this controller is being weird. There we go. Okay, yeah, I kind of I kind of like the controller. It's a little more, uh, you know. Hold on. Okay, system still. What happened to the audio? Hold on. Really? Really? Stop it! This cable is killing me. You play any back rooms games? I don't think so. Doesn't sound familiar. There we go. Is it working now? This- Nope. This cable every single time. Why does it do that? Here, I gotta do this. Um, system. There we go. Okay. There we go. Okay, so... Fabricate. Weapons. Uh, what do I got? Upgrades. Ooh, hello. Heavy attacks, uh, charge faster, less stamina, durability and force. But reduces attack speed. Charge faster and use less stamina. I think I want to use this. There you go. We'll do that. We'll reinforce it. That's a good extra weapon to use. Can I do anything to this? No. Uh, we will repair that. Oh, that's right. So it thinks it thinks this is an Xbox controller. You should play Black Backrooms Lost Tape. Okay. Actually, yeah, this is- I think this is better with a controller, this game. Yeah, I like it. I like it better with a controller, so that's to hit. 
Oh, that's just through that. Okay. That's the block. Yep. That's to throw it. Okay. I like it. Yep. Knew that was going to happen. Okay, well, so what kind of games is, what kind of game is that? Oh god. Nice. That you kid. You find that girl. Something else found her first. Son of a bitch. Well, I say it's about time we send these party crashers back to hell. So whatever that stuff is, they go after and they love it. Well, this is a nice house. Bar or anything. So where this? Where was this guy do at? He was. Oh, there he is. What's going on, Curtis? Oh, do I gotta go up there? Okay. Um, where's it telling me to go? Oh, I guess this is like a side quest thing. You actually fall into what's known as the back rooms, and there's a whole bunch of creatures and levels you try to get out. Oh, I feel like I've heard of that. Okay, that's locked. How do I get up there? No? Is he not gonna let me up? This is, this is not good. This bathroom is, uh, yucky. This looks like a wedding venue. Tony the Schemer. Um. Alright. Let's see. Right, how do I get into his house? He wants me to come talk to him. But I gotta get into his house first. Maybe the, maybe just go in the front door. No? Maybe not. It's a cool car. It's actually a really cool car. Let's see. Which way do we not go? That's locked. So, didn't this guy just want to talk to me? Hi. Hello. I was about to say, there's got to be a bad guy in there. Yeah, none of these are open, right? This door wasn't open either. Okay, well. Alright. If he doesn't want to let me in. I'm going out this way. Needs mailman's keys. Okay. I should check my map. Get lost. Yes, dude. My electrified machete is the bee's knees, man. Jump attack again. No. Oh. 
Which one's the jump attack? Great, I gotta do this again. Uh, tutorials, combat. X, drop kick, A, and then, oh, right stick. Okay, got it, got it. That's the slide. Is there extra stuff down here? Yeah. Remove the car battery to disable the alarm. Let's go in here and see what's going on. Take a shortcut through here. Sure. There you go. I'm gonna drop kick this dude. Locked. Looks like I'm breaking in. Skull stomp. You must play war games and about it. Whole bunch of great games out there. Oh yeah, there's so many. I guess we ain't getting in there, are we? Didn't mean to do that. Right. Oh. Yeah. Uh, which one's our weapon wheel? How do I swap weapons? No, I don't know how to do that. The controller. How do I do that? Provides weapons kick. Uh, didn't tell you where to swap weapons at. So there's a game called Clancy's End War, and it's a fun turn-based war game. Okay. Yeah, there's so many, there's actually some like, there's, so what I'll say is there's some really bad games out there, but there's also some really good games out there too. There absolutely is. Like, this one I had no idea would be so much fun, but this game ends up actually is actually, it's actually a lot of fun. Kind of keeps me, uh, definitely keeps me entertained when I'm playing it for sure. Hello. Ooh, do I just jump off into the pool? Play Stellaris, Warhammer 40k. Nice, nice. There's some oh hey. Some nice houses. Is it trying to get me to go? Like down here somewhere? I can't get down there. That door doesn't open, the other one doesn't open, so I guess I'm going off the thing here, huh? Oh, did I die? Wait. You can't do that? <laughs> I guess you don't jump off of that? <laughs> oh, did it let me down? Where the hell am I? Oh, I guess it let me off. Alright. See what I just did? That was a gamer move. I tricked the game into letting me down. See? Okay, 
gosh. <clears throat> You've been a gamer basically all your life, you know? I think... I don't even remember when I started playing video games. It was it was pretty early on, though. I got introduced to him by my, uh, by my, one of my cousins and my grandfather. Um, actually, my family. I started playing, like, you know, Nintendo and stuff like that. But, like, PC gaming and stuff, man. I think that I started doing that more around when I was, like, 12. Something like that. Maybe, like, 11. You started on PS2? I started on the original Nintendo, because my family had one of those. An original 10 Nintendo, then we also had a Super Nintendo, and then we had a uh, Nintendo 64. That was like my favorite thing. Um... Then of course I had a I had a Sega Saturn. Hey, what's up, yeah, I mean I, I I played a lot of games, you know. Episode number one hundred, can you believe it? It's insane. I missed. No idea. Have you guys been on that new? Oh, I broke it. Oh, it's Y. Got it. We're using the rake now. You think you own N War and you never played it? Yeah, you know, there's there's been a few of those games where like, that I've owned that I unfortunately have never like gotten a chance to play. And I feel terrible about that. Like if I own a game, it's like, dude, I really hope if I get a game, I I really hope I play it. You know what I mean? Like I would I'd wanna play it. This entire house is literally just like is this like a content house? They're just like making videos everywhere. It's so funny. Is that what they're trying to show? Like, it's just like a content house where they just shoot videos, like, at every spot of the house? Oh, the goat pen. I guess that's what it was, huh? This must have been, like, a content house. That's funny. I'm just straight up kicking people. <laughs> this guy's kick is awesome. Can't they hit him on the ground when he's like that? Nice. Now we're killing zombies with a rake. It's not as satisfying as my machete was, but I mean, I guess it's okay. This is a dope house, by the way. A rake sounds like it hurts? Yeah. <laughs> Score. I got the key card. So does that open the doors and stuff? Can I bowl? That'd be fun. Oh. Ah. Come on. There's got to be an achievement if you if you go you score like a, a strike or something, right? Oh, come on, come on, come on. We gotta do it, we gotta do it. Strike! Come on, come on, chat. Come on, come on. That's awesome. Come on. We love that. Come on. That Island 2 looks so nice on the... Yeah, it does. Like, this looks... This game looks so good, man. Oh, too bad you can't play these. That'd be fun. I always enjoy games within games, I'm telling you. 
Scraps, we need those to, to build stuff. Yep, scraps, adhesives. Alright, let's, let's go upstairs, let's see what's going on. Oh, hey. Hi, bud. Oh, did I just kill her? Took her legs right out. That's what I'm talking about. Go pin Marissa. It's a boss. She's a boss. Oh, God. Why do I keep missing with that? Nice. There we go. Dropkick Marissa across the room. <laughs> oh my god, this game is just oddly satisfying, man. It really is. We took out Goat Pen Marissa. Sorry. She was a, uh, a good content creator, but she just had to go, you know? That's all it was, man. She had to go. Uh, your guys' lunch is, uh, you know. You gotta check and make sure they're all dead. You know what I'm saying? You, you just gotta make sure. You do. Uh-oh. Stop it! You're gonna make all the people come after me. So wait, is there like a secret in here or something? Uh, they're making games like police body cams super realistic. Yeah, I wish RT and Lumen wasn't so hard on cards though. What do you mean? Oh, you, oh, you mean yeah, right on on graphics cards? Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Never mind, never mind. I had a brain fart there for a second. I agree. I do. I wish I could actually play games with ray tracing and like use the technology the card was made for without it like completely just not doing anything. You know what I'm saying? That shambler is now in shambles, chat. <laughs> anyway. Oh, you didn't go upstairs. What are you doing? I like how they all are wearing the same, like, pajamas, you know? They're kind of all wearing the same stuff. Apology script. Oh my god, okay. Let's read this. A YouTuber. I'm alone in the house. It's 1 a.m. and I just wanted to say sorry to all my fans. I'm disappointed, but most importantly, my sponsors. I'll do better next time. Cry here for sympathy. Oh my god, this isn't scripted. This is from the heart. Please take the evacuation seriously. It was a mistake. I shouldn't have joked about it. I love you all. Oh my god, that's so funny. Yep. Somebody's got to write an apology script because everybody's probably very angry. They probably said it was a joke, and then, you know, here, here all the zombies are, killing everybody. Go pen master keys. Oh, there's stuff in there we want. Where's the master keys at? Oh, we're gonna find it. There we go. There's the front door now. Don't you love how you open the front door after going to the whole place? Uh, let's see. Go pen planning. Merch meeting. 24-hour stream. That's, that's it? Okay. That's all they do, huh? They have a whole room just for that. For two things on a whiteboard. Oh, hi. Oh, I found the streaming room, guys. Let's, let's take- let's- let's steal this dude's, uh... Let's steal this dude's, uh, stream setup, huh? You gotta take advantage of that when you get the uh, the chance to do that. Oh, I broke his freaking uh
There's a stream set up, chat. It's not bad. It's not bad. The Squirm Awards. It's an alright streaming room, I guess. I'll have to just beat this dude up. Troy didn't have the master key. Uh, yeah, your arm can go down there too. No, you didn't have the master key. I, I, I literally raked his arm off. That was dope. Uh, you had totally gotten a 4090 versus the XDX I own. If frame gen didn't add severe ghosting, at least to me that goes for FSR 3.0. Frame interpolation is a joke. Yeah. Yeah, man, that's why, that's honestly, like, the re, like, for some, some, that's, that's the reason why, like, I'm okay with going with something like a, a 4070 Ti, and not stepping up to something like a 4090 or the, the XTX, you know what I mean, like, I just don't need it, it just doesn't add enough value for what I do, you know what I'm saying, for me personally, it just doesn't, Brock's safe key, where do you find all this stuff? I felt like I, I feel like I've searched the entire house. But I didn't find any of those keys. Oh, hi. Oh, I totally missed. Uh, a bunch of movies. Alright, did I did I miss anything? I feel like I looked everywhere. I never found the master keys. I mean they could also be somewhere else, I guess. Maybe down in there. Oh shit. Didn't mean to do that. Like out here? I don't know. Oh yeah, I don't think I did I go in here? I think I did, but I didn't check it fully. Um, would they be? I thought I grabbed stuff over here already. I did. I don't want to break the rake, so let me just use like. Let's use the sword. Sure, sword's pretty good. Um, I guess it could be downstairs. I don't know, the house is kind of a big map, so it could be, I don't know, there's a lot of places it could be, I guess. It ran down here all the way already. My main objective is not even in here anyway, I just kind of got carried away playing around with that. Ooh. Ah, let's just, oh, here we go. There we go. That's the easy way to kill him. What? What? Oh, okay. I was about to say, he just got so lucky. Just watch them all die. Watch this. This is fun. See ya. It didn't, it didn't get that one. Oh, shit. Noise. So do I watch anime? I actually, honestly, guys, the only anime I probably watch uh, is is Pokemon. 
like I yeah I watched Pokemon when I was like young and like oh I would watch Pokemon again but it's probably the only anime I'd watch I'm not like super into it no I don't mind it I don't think it's you know I don't think there's anything's wrong with it I just uh I just never really got into it Ooh, a shovel nice just one of those things All right. Oh, there's another walker in here. What? I was in there last time. Noise. I watch a lot only because I dislike Hollywood and crap productions. I mean, yeah, like, but that's that's why I watch like YouTube and stuff. I have like a lot of YouTube channels that I really enjoy, um, and that's because honestly, some of the YouTube creators out there, in my opinion, are like it, that stuff is more entertaining than some Hollywood films that come out these days. Like it really is. Oh, hello. The straight cut her head off, dude. My God. Need a fuse for that. Okay. We can light these guys on fire. That'd be cool. So, wait, what's the deal here? Can I, like, sneak? Okay. Back on track for the Halper Inn Hotel. Can I grab this? Can I, like, light it on fire somehow? Um, how do you light it on fire? Oops. Yeah, I don't really know how to light it on fire. I kind of just screwed that up. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I just did. I don't... How do you light that stuff on fire? Maybe you have to have a, uh, like a fire weapon or something like that, like I had with my other weapon. Um, let's try that again. I, I, I shouldn't have, I could have just gone about it a different way. I thought, um, I thought I could just like light stuff on fire right there, but I guess, I guess they're going to stay that way now, right there. Okay. See, if I knew they were going to do that, I could just let them eat this stuff and then... Okay. Killed like three of them, like by doing that. No, I died again. There's too many. Maybe Fallout 4 will be better with the next gen upgrade soon. Are they doing another upgrade on it? Alright, so. I guess I need to get to that car and undo the battery, right?
Hmm. Yeah, I guess I should have gone about that fight a lot different. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Okay, now they're really just like messing with me right now. I don't know what's going on. Throw a battery at your target to I don't know what's going on. Bethesda, Bethesda announced that Fallout 4 will receive a free next gen update at some point in 2023. Oh, okay. Then maybe that'll be fun to play. Try the axe. Yeah, this little spot right here is becoming a little difficult. They're all they're all way over I'm I'm over level too. Jeez. Some of these weapons are hard to use, man. Woo! Okay. That was a rather large area of bad guys. Um, so yeah, I went by that. I went about that fight completely wrong. Should have done that differently. I feel like there's a way to, I could have burned all of them, but I, I don't know how I would have set it, uh, uh, would have set it all on fire. That's what I was looking for. I was like trying to figure that out, but whatever. It is what it is. All right. Cool. Med kits, things, things I need. Good. Um, let's see. Honestly, Red Dead looks way too long. It's a very long game, and there's like so much additional stuff to do. That's what got me caught up in it, and that's why I never finished it because there's so much extra stuff you can do in that game. It's a really great game, though. I really need to uh, grease my keys again. I want ES5 on UE45. But at Elder Scrolls 5. Okay. <clears throat> 120 FPS, but no game. The game bug. Oh, man. So any, any Elder Scrolls game is going to have bugs. And honestly, to me, that's what makes them Elder Scrolls games, right? Yeah, so we can all dream that... They make a new Elder Scrolls that has no bugs. I mean, I would love that too. But if I'm going to be real, if I'm going to be real with myself, it's going to have bugs. All right, let's go over here. Let's go try to find these people that we're trying to find so I can get to a stopping point. Yes. Bug Thesda, yeah. As long as it is, isn't EA bugs, I'm good. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. I feel you, guys. I feel you. Make contact with authorities at the Hot Hairpin Hotel. Okay. Find the helper in hotel and tell the authorities that Mr. Immune would like a word. The soldiers at the Halpern are still alive. Nice.
Let's kick him to death. All right. Oh, yes. There we go. If a kit. Or a uh, workbench. There we go. Can I repair this? Yes. Yeah, it's back. These older weapons, I'm gonna scrap them. Nope, I wanna keep. Oh, actually, the sword is actually kinda bad now. It's only got 30, but it slashes though, so it actually is kinda good. Um, let's see. Can I upgrade any of these? No. Um, no upgrades available. I like that. Um, upgrades. Shock damage. Let's do it. Make it a shocking... <laughs> Freaking... Uh, rake. Nice. Yeah, I need to provide me Battlefield that isn't a joke like 2042. <laughs> I'm gonna make strawberry shortcake. Do it. Do it. Absolutely do it. Yeah, when I when I uh when I get off of here, I'm gonna go get me a little a little something to eat and uh just kinda chill out and watch some uh watch some watch some YouTube or something. Some channels that I enjoy. I Yeah, see, this thing does so much damage. <laughs> Speed him up on the floor. Bam. <clears throat> That's the best way to put those, put them down, so they can't get you. I don't, so... So with the fire stuff, I don't know how to start the fire unless I got a flaming item. Did I kill that guy with that? Wait, did I? Oh, what just happened? Just having my controller. Oh, okay. Oh, Still rebar, nice. Alright, we're finding some we're finding some more weapon oh I gotta kill this guy. He's in my perif. Yes. So where are these people that I'm supposed to meet up with? Uh, that's kind of cool. You can like literally see when you uh, when you get them in the head. It's kind of dope. Nice. Actually watching on your phone now? Nice. How's the stream look on your phone? Does it look good? Oh, those cities on fall lines, folks. Knew it. I knew one of them was real. So. What is going on with my controller? It's like stopping all of a sudden. Hold on. There we go. Controller's bugging out on me sometimes. Oh boy. What do you mean? 
What? My, my, oh no, my freaking controller just messed up. No. My controller is being really stupid. It's the controller is screwing up. I may have to switch back to mouse and keyboard. Yeah. It's the controller is not. Yeah. Not working too well. this there you go that's how you do that no I gotta go repair it again Come here, come down here. No. Dang it. Dude, there's actually like a lot of them that get you. I didn't realize I was going to die so much in this game. Holy crap. Yeah, it's tough when there's like this many of them, man. Jesus. Just a double kill. Holy crap, there's a lot of them. Come here. Get him to, if I just get him to run into this, they're really stupid. They'll just do it. There we go. This phone was a pre order, it still holds up to great, to be honest. What, what phone do you got? Galaxy S20 plus 5G. Nice. Yeah, I want to... What the hell is all that? Um... Here's the hotel. Yeah, I want to, uh... I'm really thinking hard about the uh, the, the S20, the newest, the newest Samsung, the, like the S23 Ultra, I think it's called. Finally, leveled up. That's what I needed to do. Now all the uh, all the zombies were like over leveling me there for a bit. You got the S23 Ultra. How do you like it? I'm I I'm used to iPhones so like if I switch will I really hate it or will it be okay oh god the 
for sure. Not as uh, lively as I'd hoped. You think it'd be okay to switch? Best phone of the best phone of the year, yeah. See, that's what I'm thinking. Like, it's it looks like too good of a phone to to not to not try it. You know. Oh yeah, I forgot you could just do that. I guess you could call me an Android fa fanboy. Depends on how far you are. I'm not in the Apple ecosystem like at all. I don't have like any other Apple products. So for me, it would make sense to have an Android like really. Like it's just, you know, the ease of use of an Apple and, and how I've liked it. But like, honestly, if Androids have come a long way with their battery life and all that, the last last Samsung I had, the only problem I had with it was the, uh, the only problem I had with it was the fact that, um, it had a really bad battery. Um, but... Other than that, it was fine. I don't have any problem with using an Android. You own both and have their pros, but honestly, but Android honestly better than everything. What? Yeah, I mean, the only thing that keeps me from not having an Android is just like my wife likes Apple products and whatnot. But I mean, I don't really care. I kind of want one. And the S23 Ultra with the camera and just like the overall use of it. Would, would fit me a little bit better, I think. And it's easier to use Android products with, uh, with like, you know, um... I almost killed it, too. Like, I literally almost killed that thing, too. That was the last one, I think. Are these- those are more one than one of these. Now, why are they so hard to kill? Oh, 
So yeah, I mean, other than other than the Apple phones, yeah, I guess the S23 Ultra would be the one I would go for, but. So this place is guarded by these really crazy zombies. So what's back here that's useful? There's got to be something good back here then. Is it this? Can I scrap some of these? Yeah, I can. Okay. Let me scrap these old ones. Like a million of these things, just scrap them. Like I'm not even using them to hit anything, so. There you go. Don't I have a new skill? No, I kind of like this. Yeah, yeah. Forty sixty Ti. Oh my God! Yeah, dude, I hate that thing. That was because so there was a nice, nice little, little weapon right there. So that's why there, those zombies were camping it. Makes sense. I need to switch my weapon too, by the way. Before. Oh, let's see. Ooh, this is cool. Alright, so, need to get in here, get to a good spot. Yeah, the 4060 Ti, man, and it's, Jack and I talked about that on stream last, last week. Get, stupid thing. Those damn cars. Eat that. This thing's nice. <laughs> oh my god, this weapon's good. Love that. Alright. Starting to figure this game out more, chat. Is, this game just makes me keep playing because it's just fun. Just running around, killing these guys. This is honestly just really fun. That is like my review for this game. It's just, it's good fun. There's another weapon back here.
definitely over. But the army can still be holed up inside. I got a feeling like there's gonna not be anybody home inside of here. So guys, if I was to get the uh, the S23 Ultra, which uh, which version, like what what capacity should I get? Biggest the biggest one, because my wife and I were actually gonna be uh, switching. I think carriers. I think we're gonna go from we're gonna switch to T-Mobile, just because it's, it's it's good for our area. Um, and I think with doing that. I'm going to uh, get a new phone, so I don't know if I want to get the new iPhone or if I want to get an S23 Ultra. So, being as I do take a lot of video and I use it for, you know, content creation, I feel like that's the phone to get. Yeah, the biggest capacity, one terabyte. Okay. Feel that makes a lot of sense. Save more videos, you know. If I got more capacity, so that makes makes sense. Got it. Ready for this? Drop kick. Boop. him in the head I gotta switch back to my my rake's broken what we got the one terabyte although I take a lot of 4k videos and it really doesn't need storage to be honest nice that's what that's what I'd be using it's a lot oh it didn't do the thing come on Have multiple 30 minute vids and only have used like 300 or give or take okay cool also get a lot, bunch of 8k video try and transfer so that that phone can take 8k video jeez yeah i probably would still keep it at 4k just because it would be able to work with my other stuff oh shit through them guys There's a lot of them but I got them
Okay. Safe deposit box keys, right? Hello. Welcome to the Halperin Hotel, where we are dedicated to providing you with the ultimate luxury getaway. For room reservations, press there you go. 1. Wedding planning services, press You got to find all the safe deposit box keys is probably a ch little For intimate weddings, challenge press 1. to do. For our grand celebration. Would you like to join our platinum membership plan? No, okay, not this. Get exclusive and Oh. Anybody want to go down the creepy hallway? I do. Oh, hello. See, you just gotta run around, you know what I mean? Hotel California, we did it. Find a way to open this door. door needs Major's master keys, okay. That guy kinda scared me a little bit. This guy oh this guy's a mover, huh? And look, listen, be my friend, please. Don't kill me. This guy's funny, I like it. It's like, it's like a, you know, it's like a horrible thing happened in the world and stuff. This guy's like being, this guy's still funny. It's like a humorous, you know, dead people game, which I like. It's very, it's very fun. And it's also a game that's pretty easy to just like talk to you guys while I, while I play it. Oh, these dang bodies, man. There's a lot of them. All right, big wide open field. What the fuck is all this? All right, investigate the hotel pool. I don't know if I want to investigate the hotel pool. That looks like it. Yeah, here, let me just. I gotta know what See ya. he was doing here. Get in the pool. Yep, that's the way. To, uh, that's how you kill all of them, I guess. Easy way to kill the, the bad things. Just kick them into the pool. So the army was developing a way to just kill them all really fast. We're pumping this crap out of the pool. Half-Life Crowbar. I know I like it, right? It's got some Half-Life vibes. I'm glad you said that. I was wondering where I've seen this before. You know, like where I've, uh, like what game I've kind of seen this before. Water. You always gotta check them and make sure. Gotta go around the back, probably. Ooh. Yikes. Um, let's see. What do I gotta... Uh oh I don't know if I'm supposed to step in that stuff or what. I don't think I am. Oh, here we go. They pumped this shit straight into the drains. Huh. Okay, what else? Let's see. What else can I see? Solvent and just toss the bodies in. When it got full, they pumped the meat soup straight into the drains. Oh, this is so fucked up. That's what I was. Oh, the meat soup. That's what I was seeing. Oh, great. She's fucking crazy. <laughs> Bug says she's behind this body melting. Uh oh. Box, open everything up. Oh, 
Oh god. So I see, you just gotta lead him to this crap. Ah. Does the pool not hurt him anymore? How does so hold on? How do I use my little thingies again? Right there, there you go. Come on. Doesn't that hurt them? I think I got them all, right? Okay. Let's go. Let's go, let's go find the major. Needs a fuse. I did not find a fuse on my journey of killing constant baddies. All right. Gotta be a side entrance or something. You always gotta check and make sure they're dead. All right. Say it once, I'll say it again. You just gotta, you gotta check if they're dead, guys. That's all. going on there He's not talking to me. Somebody has a rifle. What is she talking to? Oh. Grenades? Yeah, I'm going to go over here. Okay, stairs. I need room 307. Okay. Taking everybody's stuff. Ed kit could use that. Yes. I did that. It honestly just kind of looked like fun to do that. Where is this lady? Need the next floor up. That one looks really fun. Need the next floor up. Place looks like a lot of fun to go in. The hell? room locker key. Where do you find all these dang keys at, man? There's so many keys. I was like, where do you get them? Huh. I don't know. Whatever. Let's keep... Yep. I figured that was going to happen sooner or later.
So you just use brass knuckles. Just punch him. <laughs> um, something on fire right there. If I could get him to run in there, that'd be great. Dude, these, these are actually pretty good. Does it work? Oh, shit. I forgot I had these. Oh my god, you guys, you see this? Nice. I got- I'm freaking Wolverine. Tired. I'm actually getting off. Love the stream. No worries, man. Thank you for hanging out as always. Um, pretty sure Jack and I will be live. I think we planned for tomorrow. So uh, we'll have the... We should be having the tech podcast tomorrow night. So if you want to hang out and come, come check that out. You know where to keep those notifications on at. Right here on this channel. <laughs> And then, uh, yeah, I think Thursday, yeah, we'll be hopping into some freaking, uh, we'll hopping into some, uh, Diablo 4 action, hopefully. It's the idea, anyway. That is what I'm hoping. I'm just gonna kick him to death. Is he, st is he dead? He's not dead. There we go. All right. I'm gonna make sure I grab everything. Oh. oh, boy. Okay, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Ooh, can I get up there? Again, every time you gotta check them. Yep. Grab all this stuff. Yeah, you wanna try to run at me, son? Huh? 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 Yeah, I'll carve your brains up, brother. Dude, these are sick. It's probably my favorite weapon so far. I don't know why, but it just... Just a lot of fun. Somebody really didn't like that door? Alright. I'm really just looking for the, uh, the next, like, check- like, big checkpoint. And then I'm gonna- I'm probably gonna get off, because I'm- I'm actually getting hungry. Ooh! They tried to jump and scare me there, that they weren't gonna get me.
Yeah, look at the, the fan just blowing the flies all over the place. That's nice. Alright, so am I at a dead end? Wait, what? Hold on. Which way did I come from? Yep. Can't get up there though, otherwise that's where I would go. Oh, that's how you get around it, okay. Cool. Hello? Come on. Oh, she decided not to go that far. Floor is lava. Floor is lava. Ow. 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 That hurt. That hurt me. It's way up. If I can cut the power. Ooh, here we go. This is the room I need. Oh, storage locker. Okay. Um, a lot of this stuff. I need to just. Ooh. Very nice. Um, where the hell does that go? Okay. This might be a good place to stop. Uh, because I got a nice little spot here. I got a new blueprint. Impactor mod. So, I, is this where I get guns? Oh, also, uh, Christopher Pusey. Thank you for subscribing. Missed that notification there. Um, let me... Yeah, we can repair all of our stuff. Lots of good weapons here. Ooh, these brass knuckles are actually pretty sick. You know what I'm saying? Let me, uh... Get rid of some of these weapons that I don't use. That rebar thing is pretty cool, actually. Let me, uh... Let me, yeah. There we go. Can we do upgrades to this? No. Uh, nothing available, nothing available, nothing available. Okay, so the stuff that no, has nothing available, I guess I'll keep it around just in case I have to use it, but this one I'm going to scrap it because it is no longer, like, super useful to me. Ooh, I can make it a fire one. Let's do that. Just flame on, dude. What is this? They're really for us. Heavy attacks. Increases damage. What is increases damage? There we go. That thing's really good. Okay. I got like four. I got six weapons. I don't know if I really need to keep all these around. I'll keep one of the brass knuckles in reserve in case. Okay. Cool. Got lots of stuff to now. Well, let's see if that was the power. Okay, so I think I'm at a good a good checkpoint here. Yeah, I am. Alright. I think it's did it save? I think it did. I want to return to the menu because I think I, I think it like literally just saved. Okay. All right, guys. So we're going to quit out of the game. 
I am going to go ahead and get off and uh, and go get some food because uh, I'm hungry as crap. So anyway, I had a really good time tonight. That was fun. Uh, I enjoyed shopping around for some tech with you guys, as always. And I also enjoyed uh, playing some games, which is always a lot of fun. But guys, uh, like I said, uh, my buddy Jack and I will probably... Uh, most likely we'll be we'll be on again tomorrow night um, the usual time time probably around uh, 7 30 8 p.m. Uh, Pacific time um, is when I'll be live and we'll have some more tech content for you and possibly some more stuff I don't know I mean we might game tomorrow I'm not really sure we'll have to go over it tomorrow before we get on stream but we'll figure it out but either way you guys have a great rest of your night wherever you guys might be and uh, Catch you guys later. See ya.